Well, I just, I just did it because um, it was an emotional time, and um, uh, uh, the, um, uh, the people that, that came to do it had something to say, and um, I just sort of provided them a, a, a way to say it. So. Uh, we thought it was rather clever to come up with the, the name Hong Kong Unmasked because, of course, if SARS never happened, the word unmasking, or, you know, you're looking at something unmasked, it has this sort of slightly exciting feel that you're going to get to more depth, you're going to get more insight, you're going to get to more secrets about something. So we hope, of course, when SARS is over um, and we are back to normality, then really we can get back to telling other people about Hong Kong. And we hope the site will endure so that it will transform into something else which tells people outside Hong Kong about what Hong Kong really is about. Well, basically, we, we wanted to make people laugh, make people smile in, in this difficult time. And uh, we, my, my creative team sat around and said, what, what can we do? And with our talents, we felt that an online game would, would be the best thing to do.